My brand new Tesla has arrived. We polished it. The paint is absolutely perfect. First thing that we're gonna do, we're gonna bring it through a tunnel car wash. I'm so nervous to take my car through here. All right, here we go. Oh, you hear that? Oh, that's just not right. What's up everyone? If you haven't been watching, I just got a brand new Tesla Model 3. I picked it up from the service center a couple weeks ago and well, it wasn't so new looking. So before we actually bring it through the tunnel car wash, I'm going to be polishing the paint, removing any imperfections, including any scratches and swirls. By polishing the paint, we are removing very thin layers of clear coat. This leaves a flat layer that's going to look glossy, new and shiny. I want to show you guys the before and after after polishing so i'm just going to polish half this back deck lid so you guys can see the difference there we're also going to be putting a ceramic coating on parts of the paint just to see how they're affected while going through the tunnel car wash Car washes near me. <laughs> Car washes. You can use this. Oh yeah. How do I do this? Okay. I don't even know how to work this thing. <laughs> how do I find the internet web? Let's find a uh, tunnel car wash. In and out express. Best wash. All right. This looks like the closest one. Jet Bright car wash. It's a tunnel car wash. It's got 4.5 stars. 531 Google reviews. Let's go. All right, I know that you're probably thinking I'm a little crazy for bringing my brand new car through a tunnel car wash, but it's all in the name of science. I want to demonstrate to you guys what a, a tunnel car wash can actually do to your car and how it can damage your paint. You know, I've dedicated my career to making paint shiny, making it clean, and keeping cars looking as new as possible. And this is just a part of it. I wanna show you how to properly maintain your car and what a, a tunnel car wash can actually do. So we've polished my black Tesla Model 3 to where it's almost as perfect as possible. And we actually put a ceramic coating on half the hood, half the back door, and half of the deck lid to show you the difference and show you how to maintain and properly take care of your car. What's the best way to do that? Well, don't take it through a ton of car wash. We're gonna show you that. But a ceramic coating, as you can see on the hood, you can see how clean the ceramic coated side is versus the non-ceramic coated side. And that's just one benefit to a ceramic coating. It's gonna keep your car cleaner for longer and you're not gonna to have to wash it as often because washing it can induce scratches and swirls making your paint not look good. So what happens when you have a nice shiny car, you have a nice reflection to it. The sun bounces off of it and it reflects and it looks very deep. When you get scratches and swirl marks in your car, the sun actually refracts off the paint and it, does, it looks dull. It doesn't look as new and clean and shiny as you would like it to. So in the name of science, I'm sacrificing my car's paint to show you and demonstrate what a tunnel car wash can do to a car. And then in a different video, I'm gonna show you the proper way to wash a car if you wanna maintain. And, and, and listen, I know that the average person doesn't care about minor scratches and swirls. You know, this is, if you're like me and you want shiny, you want your car to look new as for as long as possible, you gotta maintain it. You gotta do these proper techniques to make sure that you're not instilling scratches and swirls. And, and this is kind of a, a different level of crazy. Not everybody cares, you know? If you're a person that just drives your car from A to B, A to B and you're not worried about scratches and swirls, you're probably watching the wrong channel anyways. So let's go, let's hit the car wash. <laughs> Yeah, 
can't find anybody. So I'm gonna go through, there's an attendant that's pushing the cars through. Light car wash for light cleaning only, express. $10, tire shine, rim cleaner. What should I go after? The $10 wash? I'm so nervous to take my car through here. Why am I doing this? This is not smart. I just bought this car and it's black. Is this safe to go through? It's not gonna scratch it? No. No? Okay. He said no, it's not gonna scratch. off wheel auto oh do you hear that here comes these things oh that's just not right this this is probably a bad idea What's up everybody, Chicago Auto Pros now has merch. Check it out, this is so cool. We have different colors, different styles. Check that out. You can have my bearded face right on your chest. Check out the back. We got lots of different styles, sizes, and colors. Check it out. I'll leave a link in the description below where you guys can purchase your own merch and support the channel. Crazy looking at my car <laughs> with a flashlight. <laughs> we did it. We went through the car wash. It didn't wash the back. Oh, it didn't even wash the back. It's gonna be hard to see out here. Oh yeah. It doesn't even look clean, first of all. There's all kinds of scratches on it. Look at that. That's one wash. Yeah, you can't get anything here. Let's go back to the shop. All right, uh, we went through the car wash. It was uh, exhilarating. <laughs> um, and we, we, I can see the scratches, but I don't know if we can get them on camera because of, uh, of the lights. So we're gonna bring it into the shop. You know, in, in certain lights, it, today it's a pretty cloudy day. It's hard to look at a car and know if it's like really scratched. You know, you really you see the scratches when the sun comes out and hits it with direct light. And uh, that's what we're gonna go do back at the shop. We're gonna put in, you know, use a flashlight, which represents the sun, direct light, and then you can really see the condition of the paint a little better. All right, back to the shop. Uh, I think it was like two and a half miles from the car wash to our shop. Uh, I just drove it in the shop because it's a lot easier to inspect the paint inside um, out, of that, out of that light. So let's take a look. Let's see what we got, huh? You guys see that? <laughs> you guys see the, the scratches? You saw the before this. I polished it out. Didn't do anything, didn't touch it. I got the car wash with the tire shine and you can see there is a bunch of tire shine splatter on the sides of the car and everything. You can see it all goopy and stuff. I really expected this to be a little cleaner. Like it's even hard to see the paint, but like even through this, look at that. You see that? Do you see those scratches? That's one wash. Look at that. One car wash. Imagine, you know, multiple car washes. Imagine, you know, going through a whole year, every couple weeks, doing 26 different car washes. 
it adds up really quick. Look at the, the tire shines all the way back here. You see that? That's all the tire shine. I'm gonna spray down this door with O&R. It's a, a waterless wash. It's very high lubrication. Uh, there's so much tire shine on the side of the car here, it's hard to see exactly what's going on. So I'm gonna spray this um, on the entire panel here. I can still see some tire shine even after I did that. Look at that. You can kind of see it smeared a little bit, but take a look at that paint now. You guys saw the before after I polished it. This is one wash. Those side brushes are probably the most damaging. Going side to side on here. I mean, you can see it. Let me wipe this off here. You can see that fender there, how scratched it is. Just unreal how much one wash, just one wash, what it can do to your car. Over time, think about it, uh, you know, if you're going through every couple weeks, I mean, this is just gonna multiply every time you go through the wash. A big deeper scratch right there. I'm gonna clean this top off, because look at how dirty this top is still after the car wash. I mean, you can see through it, you know, you can see some of these scratches there already. All right, it looks a lot cleaner. It's almost like there was a film on the, on the car that wasn't even washed off with the car wash which, I mean, because we did our O&R wash on this, on this deck lid here, and it looks so much better. Like there was an actual film on there. But you can still see the scratches on there. I mean, this side looks pretty good, actually, with the coating, but you come over here and you can kind of see, you know, right here, these bigger scratches. This is our non-coated side. I mean, the back looks a lot better than the sides do. You can see it still looks decent over here. I mean, there's some a little bit, because I, I don't think uh, anything actually touched back here. You saw on the back of the car. It, didn't, it doesn't even look touched, right? Look at, the, look at the side. So we haven't, you can see like there's almost a film on it. You see that film? Like the car wash didn't even take the, the actual film off. You can see through it. You can see all those scratches. So see all those scratches in there? Oh, sweet. Use our own R and wash that part of the car. I can see the little dots in there too, like I don't know what that is. You can see all the scratches back door. You can see, I mean, we have tire shine even just all the way back here, just splattered along the whole side of the car after looking at all that. That's all tire shine that just splattered from the front wheel. You can see it all the way up here. <laughs> tire shine, tire shine. You can see on the hood here, we actually have some water spots uh, from the actual car wash. And it's, it's, you can kind of see that we have a lot more water spots and stuff going on on the non-coated side versus the coated side. If you take a look at you know, from up above, I'll go, I'll pan back and forth so you guys can see what I'm talking about. But take a look at those water spots. My poor, 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 poor car. <laughs> um, why did I do this? I wanted to show you guys how delicate paint really is and how one bad car wash can cause a lot of swirls and a lot of scratches. You know, we spent a lot of time polishing it, making it almost perfect and then putting the ceramic coating on. And then one car wash like that can put in that much damage into a car. Clear coat's delicate. Um, in the next video, I wanna show you guys how to properly maintain a car, how to wash it without putting these scratches in it. So stick around, I hope you subscribe. Thanks for watching. Let me know your thoughts below.